I remember where I came from. It's so important to know where you are. Right? And I know where I am right now. How do you go from where you are to where you want to be? And I think it, it, you have to have an enthusiasm for life. You have to have a dream, a goal. You have to be willing to work for it. You will have many fond memories of your Avert experiences both on and off the field or court, but there are many exciting and challenging days ahead. Congratulations on your graduations and best wishes in the future. Excellence must be pursued, it must be wooed with all of one's might and every bit of effort that we have. And each day there's a new encounter, each week there's a new challenge. And all of the display and all of the noise and all of the glamour and all of the color, and all of the excitement, and all of the rings, and all of the money. These are the things that really linger only in the memory. But the spirit, the will to excel, the will to win, these are the things that endure. Twenty years from now, you will be more disappointed by the things you didn't do than by the ones you did do. Sail away from the safe harbor, explore, dream, discover. It's not over yet. I'd like to thank them for all their dedication and being such great representatives of Averitt. That they do an awful lot to show Averitt in a positive light in all that they do, both on the field and off the field. I know it takes a lot of time and dedication, and we really appreciate it, and we don't thank them enough. I was really surprised by how hard these student athletes work, both on the field and off the field. It takes a tremendous amount of time to compete and to succeed, and I was really impressed by their dedication. Congratulations on your hard work. Here's one of my biggest pieces of advice to any senior. Nobody can ever take it away from you. They can take a lot of things, but your education is something nobody can ever take from you. And I think that's something you need to hold close at all times. You should be proud of your time at Avery, your time uh, as a student and your time as an athlete, and the achievements you've had in the future when there are hard times in life as there always are, that can be something you can look back on and be proud of and take confidence from. But our legacy can live on. The impact can be non-perishable forever. Congratulations on uh, becoming a college graduate. And I also would like to congratulate you on your careers. The resiliency of the players and of uh, the whole team throughout the four years that all of you were there. You, you take those lessons that you learn in those situations and that's something that transfers to life. Uh, and keep in touch with all of us and don't lose these bonds that you've developed because they can, they can be precious throughout your lifetime. Failure is part of the recipe for success. It's the losers that fail once and quit. Every winner has done failed. The loser and the winner both fail. It's just that the winner gets back up and does it again. You must believe in yourself enough to be the person now of what others will remember for later. I would like to say to the student athletes who are graduating, thank you for making my experience here at Averitt exciting and eventful. And thank you for the time and the memories that you've left here at Averitt. To all our student athletes, I wish to tell you to continue to shoot for your dreams. You're able to do anything you put your mind to, and remember, don't give up on anything you choose that you want to do. You are some of the hardest working individuals that I've ever met, and you're a pleasure to be around. Your enthusiasm for your sport and academics is infectious, and continue to shine bright. Have a great year, and congratulations. Our deepest fear is not that we are inadequate. Our deepest fear is that we are powerful beyond measure. It is our light, not our darkness, that most frightens us. Your playing small does not serve the world. There is nothing enlightened about shrinking so that other people won't feel insecure around you. We were all meant to shine as children do. It's not just in some of us, it's in everyone. 
And as we let our own light shine, we unconsciously give other people permission to do the same as we are liberated from our own fear. Our presence automatically liberates others. Seniors, my message to you, cherish the time you have on campus. These are the memories you will have for the rest of your life. Cherish your teammates, your coaches. They are your family. Always remember, Averett, one team, one family. Good luck.